Hello, everyone. Good morning, good morning, good morning. I'm just going to make sure if y'all can see me on um, Facebook or Periscope, please type in hashtag live or hashtag replay in the chat real quick. All right, who do I see on right now? Awesome, awesome. All right, y'all, we got a lot of stuff coming up today. I just, uh, before we get started, I want to make a couple announcements. Uh, today, we have our Pass the Cast uh, Summit that's going to be coming up later on today at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I have, what about, what is it, like five speakers uh, that's going to be on panel today. Let me just uh, pull up the graphic for you ladies so you can check that out. Uh, today we have an amazing topic, sort of is going to really help you guys get through this uh, little bit of a storm or what have you. Uh, well, not a little bit, but you guys get what I'm saying. Um, so that's going to be amazing, awesome. And let me just pull up the graphic here real quick so you guys can check it out. Um, so as I just mentioned, later today, we're going to be kicking off our Pass the Cast Summit at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time tonight. Uh, again, I have five. Hey, Shamika, welcome to the broadcast. Hey, Mattiel. We have five amazing speakers that's going to be hop hopping on. We got Darlene Anthony from Purpose to Freedom, Stacey Simmons. Uh, we got Nedra Buckmeyer. And just so you guys know, Nedra Buckmeyer's handle is at Nedra8. So make sure you're following her at that handle. She recently changed it. Uh, we have Miss Charmaine Cardin at Charmaine. And none other than Dr. Ray Smith uh, at Dr. Ray Smith, MD. So you guys definitely want to join us again. It's going to be good morning, Shamika. How are you today? It's going to be live on Periscope. But if you guys want to register, uh, go to CamelSuccessNetwork.com and put in your information. Uh, so that way um, you can register. And I'm actually going to be um, making sort of like a replay video for those of you who are unable to make it for this evening. But if you are make sure that you guys come out and support because we got some awesome hey sasha we got some awesome information that's going to be shared another thing that i'm super excited about and those of you who just hopped on as you know make sure if you if you if you're selling a product a, or a service or a program right now i should put a uh, product service or program let me let me change this real quick uh to product service or program because some of you guys are offering programs right please put it down below um what it is that you are offering right today is friday it's time to really start to close out those loose ends and get out there and market and promote your business and i get it some of you guys are feeling uh sad stuck and fearful and overwhelmed but what is that really doing for you as a human being right? You still need to nurture the things that is going to support you, support your family, and also help others. So for those of you who are watching me for the first time, my name is Letitia Campbell. I'm your sales success strategist. I've been helping coaches, consultants, service providers, and network marketers for over a decade grow and scale their businesses by teaching you guys how to close more customers and more clients. And what we're going to be talking about today is I've been reading this amazing book. Uh, for those of you who are inside of my membership club, we are going to have our book of the month discussion coming up in about three weeks. So you guys definitely want to make sure you grab the most recent uh, book. But it talks a lot about habits, right? And we all, it's, it is so crazy how this book is even being brought up now. And thank you so much, Shoshana Krevis, uh, for, for suggesting it. But it talks a lot about habits and how uh, everything that we do ties into our habits. You becoming that that entrepreneur, you becoming that business owner that you that you really desire to be. And guys, make sure you do me a quick favor and pass this. Um, awesome. I'm glad you'll be there, Sasha. Uh, do me a quick favor, guys, and make sure that you are passing this broadcast on. This is going to be some really good information. So our habits control our lives. Our habits control our businesses, right? And if you're not, hey, Onika, how are you? And if you're not creating good habits, guess what's going to happen? Your business is going to fail, 
Your business is going to fail. Your habits have to remain constant no matter what is going on in the world, no matter what's going on at home. It has to remain constant. The reason why a lot of a lot of people fail at business because we don't know how to departmentalize things, right? We don't know how to say, even though I'm this, I'm going through this situation, I still have to run and manage my business effectively. So for those of you who are having issues taking action in your business, I actually have a workbook that I'm about to launch. It's going to be totally free. I'm actually, I have a success challenge uh, that normally my clients are a part of, but what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be pulling uh, my workbook uh, from that challenge and actually offering it to the public for no cost, right? So if you want to get go, get on my wait list to grab that workbook as soon as I launch it, go to camelsuccessnetwork.com because I'm only allowing a certain number of downloads uh, for this workbook. So you definitely want to go over and check that out. So our habits control, our habits determine the results of our businesses. Our habits determine the results of our bank account. Whatever's in your bank account right now or whatever is not, hey, Smiley, how are you? Or whatever is not in your bank account right now is a direct reflection of your habits. Can we all agree on that? Can we all agree on the fact that you could have done more, right? Or you could have uh, 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 make sure you stay consistent. I mean, it's multiple things, right? But we can't focus on what we did or didn't do in the past, right? We can only focus on what? Moving forward which is so important. Moving forward is so important. So I want to help you guys out here today. Yes. Thank you, Onika. You told, Onika, am I saying your name right, sis? Thank you. you. I'm glad that you agree. And those of you who are just hop on, let me just reintroduce myself real quick. My name is Letitia Campbell. I'm your sales success strategist. I've been helping coaches, consultants, service providers, and network marketers for over a decade grow and scale their businesses by teaching you guys how to close more clients and or customers, right? Uh, also, what I want to mention is later on today, I'm going to be doing a special Q&A call. I've been doing these Q&A calls every single day this week at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time, but it's not going to be here. It's not going to be on Periscope. It's going to be inside of my Success Mastermind community on Facebook. So if you guys want access to that community, uh, make sure that you go to camelsuccessnetwork.com. Uh, if you anybody want the link, I can actually... Uh, put the link in the chat for you guys, the direct link. Uh, let me just grab it here so you guys can see it. And also, hello, who on here has a business? Is anybody offering a product service or program right now? And you want to sh share it in what, you know, you want to talk about it in the chat. Uh, please let us know who you are, what you do, and what's the most important thing, which is how can we get in contact with you? So if there's people on here that needs what you have to offer, how can they reach you? How can they uh, start the conversation? Okay, that by far is so important. So let's jump into number one, guys. Let's jump into number one. Uh, why is it so important uh, to create habits? And those of you, I uh, just put in the link over here on Facebook for my success mastermind community, like I just mentioned, I'm going to be doing a um, Q&A call. I'm going to be doing a Q&A call at 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. So if y'all have any business questions, uh, make sure you join us to 6 p.m. today inside of that group. If you're watching on Periscope, just go to my bio and click the link. And I think it's like the third button on that page. Hey, Michelle, how are you? So yeah, so definitely, guys, you can just ask your questions during today. We had some great questions this week. We I answer questions about how to design your funnels. I answer questions on how to close more customers and clients. I answer questions on how to build your ascension model. I answer so many awesome questions that gave so many ladies this week breakthroughs. So I would love to invite you guys in uh, so that way you guys uh, can join, okay? Okay, we got Onika here. She said, I have a mentor group for risk. Uh, youth and ex-offenders. Amazing, Onika. How can people co um, connect with you? How can people connect with you? Okay, great. We have Sasha on here. Sasha Figueroa we're here. I'm an online business manager and system strategist. Right now, I'm offering a system setup package. Everyone has all these moving parts in their business, social media, posting, sales, processing, marketing systems, and are all over the place. Absolutely. Uh, that's where I come in. Uh, Figueroa virtual Yes, there's so many that, you know, a lot of people mention that to me when, um, 
when I'm doing discovery calls. They, they're saying there's so many moving parts. There's so many that keeps them from creating a sales process, right? Because they're looking over at the competitors or they're looking at particular people who have all these bells and whistles, have all these amazing websites, funnel designing and things like that. And they lose the fact that, hello, you have to create your own unique sales process, which brings me into number one. The first thing you guys have to understand is that you got to discover what is that one unique problem that you that you provide a solution for. Somebody's put that in the chat. What is that one unique problem that you provide a solution for? What is that one unique problem that you provide a solution for? Obviously, many of you guys who have been marketing and promoting your businesses online for a while, you start to discover that you actually provide a solution for multiple different things. But nowadays, people, you have to be specific to that one problem, get clear on what it is that you offer, what it is that you provide a solution for, and focus on that. If it's too many different things, people get so super duper overwhelmed. They really, really do. And that's how a lot of people get stuck on really trying to figure out what you do like for example it was a gentleman like like posting ads and one one day he's doing something for um uh business owners and the next day he's doing something for paralegal so i'm getting all these ads on my timeline i'm like wait a second well what does he do exactly because now i'm confused i thought to, yesterday he does paralegal help people who are uh in the whole you know, paralegal industry. And now he's helping small business. It just gets very, very confusing nowadays when people are really not clear on what it is that you provide a solution for. And a lot of times if you're offering solutions for multiple things, a lot of people assume that you don't have time to really help them because you're trying to, you're trying to do all these different things um, and not, and not be more narrowed down and specific to that one thing uh, that you provide a solution for. Okay, so Onika says she also does taxes and fi uh, financial businesses. Honestly, Onika, I think you should definitely lead with that right now since that is a huge need, uh, especially now. I know uh, they've extended the tax deadline date, and also people are now seeing that they did not have barely enough money to uh, for their nest egg. Uh, for example, most people have not have uh, saved have not even saved. Uh, as more as a thousand dollars in their bank in their savings account, you know what I'm saying? So a lot of people were very unprepared for this particular uh, uh, crisis that's going on right now. So honestly, um, uh, when, when you look at product and demand, right? Product and demand, we always want to we always use that word in the sales industry. Um, that right there, taxes and financial business um, education is definitely important. Also, educating our children as well. You know, get now that the children are home, it's very important that you know parents start to educate our kids of all this, all this matter because you know something will come up in their lifetime. You know, as they get older. All right, www.otbrownglobal.com. Awesome, great, 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 great. Yes, Sasha, what one? What is the one unique problem that provide that you provide a solution for? Yes, Anika, what is that one unique problem? that you provide. I was going to about exactly this today. Okay. Message me. I know Sasha, you messaged me, um, about the other thing. I'm definitely going to get back to you on that today. Today I'm playing sort of like catch up. There's a lot, lots and lots going on. Hey, Shoshana, how are you? How are you? How are you? How are you? All right. Great. You awesome. You, uh, Onika go lead with that. Lead with what's, which, what is in demand right now. Lead was what, and it's not just going to be, <laughs> And what you're doing is not just going to be in demand right now. It's going to be in demand for a long time. <laughs> it's going to be in demand for a long time, guys. So, yes, those of you who just hopped on, please make sure that you are letting us know. Uh, do you sell a product, service, or program? Promote, promote, promote in the chat, okay? So, oh, before I move on to number two, who has went to, gone to camelsuccessnetwork.com? There's three things you guys have to do today. Number one is you got to get on my wait list to grab my success, uh, my success challenge workbook. Okay. That's going to be launching soon. It's totally free. All you have to do is go to camelsuccessnetwork.com, click that first button and grab it. Okay. Number two is that you have to register for our past cast. It's going to be, we're going to be kicking off this evening at 9 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I have some amazing, awesome speakers that's going to be joining us uh, for this evening. So please make sure 
that you go there and register. And the last thing is tonight, today at 6 p.m. Eastern, I'm having a special uh, Q&A call at 6 p.m. I'm going to be extending my Q&A calls, guys, my live Q&A calls. Um, I know I, I was going to end it tomorrow, but I'm going to extend it on until next Tuesday uh, because you guys need it. You guys need it. So if you have questions, burning questions that you need answered, uh, please go to CampbellSuccessNetwork.com and uh, I'll be doing my call at 6 p.m. sharp today, but you got to go inside of my success mastermind uh, community. I'm not going to be doing the call here. Um, now, we talked about this yesterday, which is number two is knowing what people are missing out on if they decide not to purchase your product, your service, or your program. I'm going to repeat this again. Knowing what people are missing out on if they decide not to purchase your product, service, or program. Okay. I want to do a quick exercise. If someone says no to your product, service, or program, tell me the three things that they're going to be missing out on. Okay. Three things, guys. Y'all should know this off the bat. If you don't know it, really think hard. This is so important. Right, because a lot of times we get so upset when people tell us no. Right, and we we sit back and we're like, oh my god, maybe what I'm offering sucks. And we turn around and really put a high amount of value on what we're offering, and really turn that no into saying, really, well, this this person is really you know missing out on all these things. It's so sad uh, that, that they decided like not to, decided not to move forward with me. But you got to know right? You got to know what are the main things? What are the major things? Three things that that person is missing out on if they decide not to take your offer. All right, Sasha, you go, girl. See, connections, guys. That's why I tell you guys to share your product, service, or program in the chat. So many awesome connections. So I want y'all to really think about that. Why y'all um, writing that down? I want y'all, I'm going to move on to number three, which is just so important that you're very clear on your process. Yes, get very clear on your process. Sasha said, time, clarity, business growth. There you go. Time, clarity, business growth. A lot of entrepreneurs, you know, and, and one of the things about, ooh, did my connection go out? Lord Jesus, give me one second, y'all. All right, am I back? Guys, listen, type in one on Facebook. I know I'm still coming in clear on Periscope, but those of y'all who are watching on Facebook, type in one of y'all can still hear me. But especially nowadays, it's, it's, it's a great time for us to like step back and breathe. Thank you, Shoshana. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's very important that we step back and breathe, but some of us don't have the time to do that because we're doing, we're solopreneurs. How many of you guys are a solopreneur where you're doing every single thing by yourself? And if you are solopreneur, you'll find it harder and har harder and harder to close more customers and or clients if you are a if you're doing every single thing by yourself, right? And some people some people do it to save money, right? Because they like listen, if I pay a VA or if I pay uh, somebody to manage my business, that's more money I'm giving out. But look at but if you really look back, there's a lot of things in your business that you are that you are spending money on that's not producing your profits. So sometimes you need that that body, that person to delegate things to or to help you create a structure in your business. So I was having a conversation yesterday with somebody during a discovery call. And I helped her build a whole ascension model on her business. But I told her, you're not going to be able to do all these things alone. You need so you need help. You need assistance. You're not going to be able to really help your, your, your private VIP clients at the top if you don't get help at all these other things at the bottom. Right? Everything you do on the back end does, does take customers and does take time away. Uh, for my clients. So we got to make sure, guys, that we are saying, listen, and I got to get clear on my process. And I got to get clear on the fact that whatever I am spending my real time on is something that's producing me revenue, right? Making graphics does not produce you revenue. 
right? You building your own website does not produce you revenue, right? It does not. You follow you you like you follow up follow up yes produce you revenue all those stuff is good connect to connecting with people moving people forward all those things help you but a lot of us say whenever I ask somebody why haven't you followed up with your with your customers clients why haven't you followed up with your prospects why are you not growing your list I don't have time but you have time for everything else it's not producing you income you guys you guys get what I'm saying so it's, we got to be very clear on we got to create our process and we got to make sure that with the process that we're creating, we're actually connecting with the people um, that we need to close. Now, the last point I want to make, which is a point that I heard just recently that was like blew my mind away is, is this, is that you got to find different ways to say the same thing. Yes. Uh, Shoshana income producing activities. Absolutely. You got to find different ways to say the same thing. If you're saying different things all the time, you're taking people's attention away from your offer, right? So I tell people, try not to recreate the wheel. If you already have, uh, am I uh, coming through good, guys? I'm, I'm breaking up. Look at that. Well, it looks like I'm breaking up, but that's okay. Let me see if I'm coming back. Lord Jesus. Hold on. Sorry, Periscope. Yeah, well, that's my last point I want to make, guys, is that you got to find different ways to say the same thing. Okay, so we can start to get very, very creative with your words. Uh, those of you who are in the membership, I'm going to be off giving away my words that sell. Um, um, so make sure you guys look out for that. So listen, I'm going to hop off because it looks like Facebook is having some uh, connection issues, but let's, but make sure you guys head on over to camel success um, go to those links, register, get on my wait list, uh, and make sure that you are signed up to join my Q and a call at 6 PM Eastern standard time. As always, don't forget, get out there and dominate because it's time to design a life that you in fact deserve. Bye guys.